you know, gross domestic product probably does three words that mean nothing. <laughs> Three words that mean almost nothing on their own and certainly mean nothing together, but it's really size. Like, how big is the U.S. economy? The answer is GDP. Can you remind us what the formula is? I feel oh, like I you told me. It's C plus yeah. G plus X plus... <laughs> Sorry. I got so excited. Oh, man. Uh, it's C plus G plus I plus X sub N, which is the consumption of households, the consumption of governments, the consumption of business, and X sub N, which is your net exports. C plus G plus I plus X sub N. I don't know why I always say X sub N. I could just say X, C G I X. Because it sounds more scientific if you say it. It does. X I'm like, N. this is X sub N from Dr. Edwards. C plus G <laughs> plus I plus X. Households, businesses, government, mutually exclusive and exhaustive uh, agents in our economy add in what we send and get from other places, and you have the size of the U.S. economy. And it is. Yeah, I mean, if the economy goes, if this number falls, we are almost always in a recession. If if this number grows, it means that we think the economy is strong. And it's not just what it measures, but how people respond to its performance that, in, that, that influence so much about the economy. And it is truly not doing what it was meant to do. 